I'm Molly Lesser and I grew up in the north suburbs of Chicago. I always had an interest in science and I always had an interest, some of an interest in medicine, but I think I really decided for sure after college. And I decided to work as a medical scribe in the emergency room just to make sure that I really did like medicine and I absolutely loved working there. I really got to see everything that the doctors did and be there for all of the moments. I would uh, follow around the physician and create the electronic medical record for that patient. I really learned a lot of medical terminology. I also really loved the fast pace aspect of the emergency room and it also confirmed that I was not gonna faint when I saw blood or something that maybe other people might think is gross and um, just that I was always excited to go to work and that was really fun for me. That's what solidified my decision to apply to medical school. <laughs> That's one of the most amazing parts about Rush is that everyone really is supportive and a community and it doesn't feel competitive within the class, which I think is one of the main reasons I wanted to come to Rush. I wanted to be in a place where I felt like I was working with my peers instead of competing against them and I think that it's really great how much everyone supports each other here. Before coming in, everyone warns you about the massive amounts of information that you have to learn, and it's totally true. I feel prepared in terms of that I've seen difficult material in science coming from being a neuroscience major at the University of Michigan, but it's just a massive amount of material. What do we know about what courses through the inguinal canal? I think something that surprised me that I liked a lot was anatomy lab. I wasn't sure how I would feel about dissecting in general. For me, I'm kind of an active learner, so I really learn well from when I finally find the nerve or the vessel or something myself, and I can remember it and picture like where that was in, uh, in our cadaver's body and what leads to what, and just kind of the overall 3D structure is much easier for me to learn from than looking at a flat slide. I think just generally figuring out the balance between studying and everything else that I want to do, all the clubs or fun things I want to do, and then just hanging out with family and friends. Uh, so still, we're, everyone I think is always working on that balance in life, right? But um, that's definitely something that's kind of a constant reevaluation. I find. I would say our class is pretty social and likes to do fun things, take a break, and. Um, so I've been on a few intramural sports teams this year, so over the summer we're doing an intramural softball league. I've never played softball before. One way I've grown is that I've really started to get to know different settings that I may or may not want to work in in the future. So different populations that I might want to work with and kind of finding my balance and comfort in talking to patients, so that was new for me. I'm definitely interested in pediatrics. I'm also really interested in developmental behavioral pediatrics. I just keep adding things to the list um, instead of narrowing it down at this point. 